Okay, so I've previously mistakenly said that these radios can't scan for the DCS code that's being used on transmissions over the air when in fact they can and I'll demonstrate how to do that. So it's pretty much the same procedure as scanning for CTCS codes that's been covered in my uh, previous video but for now let's just jump to how, uh, how to do it for DCS. So once again, we have to be in frequency mode, which we are now. And as we can see, both radios are set up to transmit and receive at the frequency above, frequency A, which is 446.043. So as we can see, it's, it's being picked up. Um, so it doesn't really matter which we use because they haven't got the DCS, no CTCS set up at the moment. But let's just use this one to transmit and use this one to scan. So first off, let's go to the transmit DCS menu once we find it. Okay, and let's just set a code here. So let's just set this code to D047N. Okay, so now we can see that when we transmit the DCS icon illuminates, but say we don't know what the DCS code is being used to for the transmission by this guy and we want to scan for it so pretty much the same thing ba basically we just go to menu uh probably 11 nope that's ctcs Oops. menu 10 so we go to the receive dcs menu and once again the trick here is to pre-select one of one of any uh, DCS codes because if we once again if we leave it at off and we press the scan button nothing's going to happen so I think this is a design flaw in the firmware that Bofeng has created but uh, if we pre-select any code and just press that to accept it the objective is just to get the DCS icon to appear so just select a code now go back down now instead of selecting another code yep, don't bother with that just press the scan button just tap it and now we can see the DCS icon flashing and that's what we want. Once we get to that, then we know it's scanning for DCS code. So we can go ahead and broadcast and it's going to look through all the DCS codes until it finds the correct one. So it's found 047, which is exactly what we set on the transmit DCS code here. So that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.